Yes, hello, ladies and gentlemen, Target Wrestling fans, one and all. Welcome back to another fantastic matchup here we have installed in an intergender tag match. Introducing first, he is Project Eagle, Martin Kirby. Always a fan favourite. The Angel of the Ring, Zaya Brookside, making it. Hang on a minute, what's this? They're not the champions. Ridiculous things going on here in the opening stages of this contest before the referee gets a chance to ring the bell. Martin Kirby and Zaya Brookside have decided to confiscate the titles from Medallion and Ivy Mist in a display of petulance. That seems to have got the crowd nice and riled up and on their side. It looks like we're going to start with surely not. There's a bit of a debate over who's going to be starting this contest. Zaya Brookside is smiling, but I don't think she'd be smiling for too long if she did have to go one-on-one -on -one with Medallion. Or in fact, even Ivy Mist as well. The women's champion, the first ever Target Wrestling women's champion, Ivy Mist, won the belt here in the venue last month after performing double duty in a semi-final and a final of the women's tournament. A nice moment shared between Medallion and Ivy Mist there. And a cheeky moment from Mr. Martin Kirby that we've uh, become quite accustomed to. These two men, Medallion and Martin Kirby, have tied up a lot over the years. This time, Martin Kirby has brought a different partner to his side. As we see both men. A test of strength here. It wasn't going to take a genius to figure out who was going to win that test of strength as Medallion once again with a knee to the midsection. Now with the headlock. Set off the ropes here by Kirby. And the dominant medallion, the monster of Target Wrestling, and also our newest heavyweight champion off the ropes, looking for that splash. Kirby's on the trip, rolling backwards and forwards, a triple attempt at the trip, and it's a beautiful drop kick from Martin Kirby, who did actually offer medallion, their heavyweight champion, out for just a singles contest, and was turned down. And Zaya Brookside, respectively, offered Ivy missed out for a single contest and was also turned round as Medallion has tagged in. Ivy missed. And Kirby has tagged in Zaya Brookside, formerly of NXT UK. And world class wrestling over on ITV. Currently a member of the Stardom Rustler, Rasta, over in Japan. Manages to evade. Ivy Miss, the goddess of the ring. Zaya Brookside, the daughter of NXT WWE's biggest trainer, Robbie Brookside. So, Brookside, look at that old scouse saw poplar. And they're both scouts. Anyway, Zaya Brookside is winding up the women's champion here, Ivy Miss, who has a lot of power and clean lifts Zaya up onto that top rope into the corner cameraman scrambling and so is Zaya to create some distance and she's managing to do it with a beautiful head scissors takedown and a drop kick as well to Ivy Mist though who stays on her feet another drop kick and Ivy Mist has just stumbled into the corner I believe Kirby's been tagged in and Brookside's been caught she needs a partner Uses Zaya's back to his advantage, hits a third drop kick, and the referee has been distracted. And Medallion has given the advantage to Ivy Mist. And uh, I've seen that more than once here at Target Wrestling. The inside of the ring tagging seems to be a fine thing to do here at Target. That's absolutely fine. Them's be our house rules. 
as the referee goes for the pin. And Medallion, in classic Medallion style, disagrees with the speed of the count. And I have to agree with the referee on this occasion. Big body slam from Medallion. And now Medallion allowing himself to be body slammed onto Martin Kirby by the powerhouse that is Ivy Miss. Just the two count there. Zaya Brookside is arguing with the referee once again. She wants to be careful that she doesn't give Medallion another chance to retake a sneaky advantage. As Ivy Miss sends Martin Kirby off that top turnbuckle. And now Medallion tagged back in. Sends him scrambling through the middle ropes. And I think we're going to see some shenanigans here. As Ivy Miss is on the outside. Sends Kirby into the ring post. And claims to have nothing to do with the anarchy on the outside. I'm pretty sure she's still covered as Brookside is distracting the referee. Still complaining. And Martin Kirby is receiving a lot of punishment now in the apron of the ring. Medallion with that pointed elbow across the chest. Medallion now centre of the ring with the neck breaker. And he's saying it's almost over to Zaya Brookside. He's gone for the pin. It's a bit lackadaisical and Kirby does kick out. Medallion looking to stay in between Kirby and his tag team partner. Tags back in Ivy Mist and both send Kirby off the ropes. And it's a double. Oh, whoa, a tandem move there. Very stylish stuff from Medallion and Ivy Mist. And Mist with that leg drop. Referee. Quickly for the pin. Two. Now we're still going in this contest. But Martin Kirby is getting more and more desperate to make the tag, you would say. As Ivy Mist with that camel clutch. Sitting deep along the spine at the bottom of the back of Martin Kirby there. And uh, loses grip as she went for a hair pull and maybe forgot the most important thing about a hair pull. As she sets Kirby into the middle rope. And applies a lot of pressure. Brookside keeps getting hot-headed, keeps getting in the ring. And look, Medallion keeps making Martin Kirby pay for it. She needs to calm down. She needs to let the referee do a job because she's leaving Kirby out to dry on those circumstances. I love the enthusiasm, I love the energy. But she has to realise that when the referee's backs turn, these two bad guys are going to do what they want. Martin Kirby is receiving a lot of punishment, set up in the corner, gets the boot up in time though, and he's on that middle rope. Big missile drop kick, beautiful stuff. And now, with the time to make the pin, Medallion versus Brookside, and she's hitting those forearms with as much as she can muster. Chopping across the chest with those forearms. Misses the lariat. And it's a beautiful head scissors takedown. Into the corner. And, and it's double punishment from Brookside. He manages to take down Ivy Mist. And she's going to go for the pin here against the champion medallion. Who manages to kick out. After that fall away neck breaker from Brookside, who actually has the advantage in this contest. Oops, spoke too soon. Oh! And the twirling back breaker there could be enough. No, it's not. Not quite enough. Brookside still in this contest. Brookside and Kirby still fight on. And you would say if they can win this contest, they both might actually earn themselves an opportunity at those respective title belts. Now with Ivy Mist in the ring, classic Ivy Mist dragging her opponent's face across that top rope from corner to corner. Now sends Brookside into the opposite corner and follows up with the Mist Splash. And now we're going to see the Mist hip. Oh, Ivy Mist's hip right into the face of Brookside and that will be enough to... No! 
Brookside still in this. A very hearty kick out from Brookside, who's now just been choked out like a dog in the middle of the ring. Referee forced to do another pin there. Counts just the two. As it looks like Medallion and Ivy Mist are starting to run out of ideas here. Brookside has managed to stay in this contest. Oh, Mishinoku driver goes to the pin. And it's broken up by Kirby. And if Medallion could have hooked that leg, might have seen a winner in this contest. And she once again has Brookside up. Just hits the world's strongest slam straight down across his opponent. No, surely not on that middle rope. Kirby at least allowing Brookside to get the distraction with a step up in Zaguri kick. And now has both hands together. Whoa! Sends Medallion off for of that middle rope. Sent on in himself into the ring. And both. People are down in this contest. I don't think Medallion knows what corner he's supposed to be crawling towards. And I think now he's finally realised where he is. Brookside and Kirby have made the tag. And so has Medallion and Mist. Mist and Kirby in the ring now. And Kirby with some big running forearms. Manages to take Ivy Mist off her feet. And she's in the corner now. Kirby big spear. Oh, it's all over with the cutter. The Kirby Cutter, what's he looking for now? Big super kick. Pulls Ivy Mist into the centre of the ring and goes for the pin. Medallion scrambles in and somehow breaks up the pin. Just about reaches and gets enough force across to break up that pin. And Kirby's calling for the super kick once again. It's been caught, missed. Pushes Kirby off the ropes, which sends Brookside to the outside. Kirby with his back turned to miss now, though. Up on the shoulders. Good night. Fogs landed. And the miss descends. And Ivy missed the medallion. Your respective target women's champion and heavyweight champion are walking away victorious in this contest in an absolutely... Stalemates of a matchup. It was very even throughout, even though the weight advantage was massively with the champions. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and bye for now.